Hey Browns fans, Nathan Zagura here with a game preview edition of the Two Minute Drill brought to you by University Hospitals. The battle for Ohio takes place on Monday night at First Energy Stadium. The two and five Browns against the four and three Bengals. Two teams unfortunately right now going in different directions. The Browns have lost four straight. The longest such streak under head coach Kevin Stefanski while the Bengals have won four of their last five and they've done it on the back of an excellent offense and an excellent defense. They are both uh, number 11 in total offense and total defense. They're top 10 in both scoring offense and scoring defense. But at the end of the day, it all starts and stops with Joe Burrow, who led the Bengals to the Super Bowl a year ago. The quarterback has been sensational since week two. Top three in every single passing category in the NFL. And over the last two weeks, he's been even better. Almost 800 yards passing, six passing touchdowns, two rushing touchdowns, no interceptions, and a quarterback rating of more than 130. But Burrow won't have his full complement of weapons in this one. Jamar Chase, we learned late in the week, will be out with a hip injury. And for a team that plays 11 personnel, that's three receivers 98% of the time and throws it around the yard, that's a big loss. Chase currently number six in the NFL in receiving, leads their team in receiving yards and touchdowns. But they have two very good complementary receivers, T. Higgins, the first pick of the second round a few years ago, and Tyler Boyd, both on pace for over 1,000 yards themselves this season. So the Browns pass defense is still going to have to be ready. They're going to be in the shotgun will the Bengals about 88% of the time. They are going to throw the football all over the yard. And so yes, they've got Joe Mixon, the very talented running back who has been very successful over the course of his career against the Browns. Struggling this year though, career low, 3.3 yards per carry. So how do you disrupt them? One, you got some good fortune with Jamar Chase. Two, you're going to have to get after Joe Burrow. The Browns have won the last four meetings with the Bengals. They are three and against Burrow and that's because they have sacked him 12 times in those three games. They're able to force turnovers because they're able to get after him and generate that pressure. He's thrown three interceptions in the last two games alone. So Miles Garrett, Jadevian Clowney, Taven Bryan, Jordan Elliott up front, they've got to generate pressure. Maybe we'll bring some nickel blitzes. We did that last year in Troy Hill. The Brown slot corner at the time had two sacks. So that's what you got to do. Disrupt Burrow. The ball's going to come out quickly, but if you get a chance to get after him with an offensive line feature four new starters that is hugely important for the Browns defense and then offensively just keep doing what we're doing but take care of the football last week Brissett 22 of 27 throwing the ball for over 258 yards you had Nick Chubb running for 90 plus yards at nearly six yards a carry we were efficient but our turnover cost us and on the season the Browns 2-0 and when they don't turn the football over 0-5 when they do so take care of the football go out there and pound the Bengals and get a big win win on Halloween night. This one, it's critical, folks. You got to get this one. If you do, you go to 2-1 and one in the division. The Bengals would fall to 0-3 oh in the division, and you'd still be within striking distance of the first place Baltimore Ravens, who you just played tough a week ago. We'll have full coverage for you, as always, this whole weekend and getting you ready. We got a Browns countdown on Sunday, as usual, 10.30 a.m. on News 5, and then radio broadcast on the University Hospital's Cleveland Browns Radio Network starts at 4 p.m. on Monday. Getting you ready for the Browns and the Bengals. It's a big one. Thanks for watching another game preview edition of the Two Minute Drill brought to you by University Hospitals.